King of Sports. New Japan Pro Wrestling. Second match, a singles contest, one fall with a 20 minute time limit. Oh. Here we go. Wow. You get chills. Oh, I, yeah. This royal theme music is only of one man, one person. El Rey. Big poppy pump. Mr. Yosa, let me tell you, Kevin Kelly, he is made like no other. I've heard it before. When Mr. Yosa drinks pee, his asparagus smells funny. Wait, what? I've heard that that's like a health and nutrition Ooh, craze. Great dog army, 5 foot 11 inches, 218 pounds. Mr. Yosa! Mr. Yosa, of course, we found out over the last couple of years has helped busloads of orphans, uh, has done remarkable things, and, and seemingly almost defies gravity in the ring for a man his size. Oh, absolutely. He is very, very deceit. I mean, you look at him, he's a heavyweight, but the way that he flies, it's incredible, like, like a junior. But. Man, right out of Arena Mexico, one of the top legendary names in CMLL. Did you, I meant to ask you, have you wrestled Mystico before? Yes, I, I actually had the opportunity of wrestling him many, many times, and there he is. Look, when I arrived in Mexico, Mystico was one of the biggest stars in that country. He was like El Hijo del Santo. He was like El Vampiro Canadiense, like Conan. He was one of the biggest. This guy, is incredible. The legend, Mystico. Red Corner, CMLL. Mystico! And also, Mystico coming off uh, a win, along with Rocky Romero in Arena Mexico in a tournament called Copa Bicentenario, which is Referee celebrating. Rico celebrates the, the diplomatic relationship between the United States of America and Mexico. This is gonna be a, a hell of a match. Yeah, they have blended teams with uh, American wrestling stars, CMLL stars, tradition going back. And again, we're talking about the oldest wrestling promotion continuously running since 1933. So we're right there at, uh, you know, kicking off what their, what would be their 90th year? My goodness. I mean, look at, at New Japan now in year 51. <laughs> the, the number yeah. of years in CMLL is just dwarfs it. Taking the bigger Mysterioso over. Now, of course, Mystico can do anything he wants at any time. Mysterioso will try to exert his power. That's how you take care of a bigger opponent. I love it. Well, I mean, if you look at well, what's gonna happen, even though it looks like an even exchange here, I mean, Mystico's uh, strategy, I think, here will be to slow down Mr. Yoso. Try to have Mr. Yoso expend as much energy as possible. Ooh, just ran into a brick wall, and let's not forget Mr. Yoso is extremely lactose tolerant. Mysterioso off the ropes. Mystico setting him up here. Uh oh, they both have oh, the same idea man. at the same time. That's vintage Mystico right there. So fast is Mystico. Watch out. Oh man, but that's right the power. into the power of Mysterioso. And of course, the Mexican wrestlers are notorious for showing up when they feel like it. And I've heard it described by you that that's actually Mysterioso One. time. Well, well yes, exactly. And listen, Mysterioso does, Three. that's why he doesn't wear a watch. Four. He decides what time it is. 
And what time it is for Mysterioso could be victory time. What would this mean a victory for Mysterioso over a legend like Mystico? Oh my God. I mean, what a, it, it wow. would mean huge. I mean, not only would it make Bateman, the leader of Stray Dog Army, right. the man that has collected Mysterioso and Barrett Brown together into Stray Dog Army. What a win for Mysterioso would be a win for Stray Dog Army. Eight. Pay attention to the referee's count. Mysterioso will get back in as halfway to a count. Up rolls in, rolls back out to continue the punishment on Mystico out here on the floor. One. So our main event, our strong open weight title match at the culmination of the Nemesis Tour will take place next. Immediately following this, Mysterioso in firm control, punishing Mystico on the outside. And I mean, look, uh, right now his his strategy is uh, very effective. He has slowed down a faster opponent that is Mystico. Look at that. Oh, man, that's a lot of weight coming down on the sternum. It certainly is. Is it enough to? No, it's not. Having such a such a heavier opponent on top of you, even on that pin, it takes so much more effort to kick out. Mystico trying to wriggle off the hook that Mysterioso has him latched onto. He is not giving Mystico a chance to breathe. But I I like what Mystico did right there. It actually can help him, rolling One. out. He's buying himself some time, Two. regrouping. But Mysterio's so smart, you know, he's not letting him have too much time. He's going after him. He's been around the block. Oh. He understood how about Yeah, I think, and he saw Mystico favoring that hamstring area earlier on. He continues to clutch at it, and that's where that toe of the boot landed. Oh! But it's not negating any of Mystico's ability to fly. Perhaps a little bit of the old possum game. Well, I mean, Mystico's also known for his great, incredible recuperative yeah. abilities. That's the thing, you know, professional wrestlers, CMLL stars, anywhere around the world, the top, top guys like this, like Mystico, yeah. they train their bodies for this. They're prepared for this. Five minutes have passed, five minutes. Mysterio trying to duck, but Mysterioso, look at that. Oh, gets it that time. And sends Mysterioso flying. Well, we've already seen Blake Christian victorious and sending some harsh words Juice Robinson's way as he was exiting. Oh, oh watch this, my oh. God! Second successful aerial offense on Mysterioso. If he can capitalize, roll Mysterioso in. He has a he has a good opportunity to finish him off. And it looks like Mystico will be able to break the count, but he's going to work towards getting Mysterioso back into the ring and does so. Again, this Vermont Hollywood crowd, such a cross-section with melting pot of, of wrestling fandom and under the New Japan Strong banner. You look at uh, fans who come from a Mexican background, you know, they grew up watching CMLL and stars like this to go. Oh, and Mysterioso oh. nails him. It does smell in here. No, please. Cover two. You have fond memories of your time in CMLL. How dare you? No, I'm not talking about CMLL. I am not talking about oh. Mexico. I'm talking about Vermont, Hollywood, oh, LA. Okay. But that's what makes this venue so great because it, it brings every fan flavor of, of wrestling from the generations. Mysterioso lands that kick. He'll go for a cover here. Two. And Mystico gets that shoulder up. So it's really been back and forth. Mysterioso now trying to clear the cobwebs. He'll be looking to dial up some power offense. Mystico, once again, looking for that surge of adrenaline he's so famous for. This 
saw how hard he was shot corner to corner. Mystico now put down. Mysterioso keeping him right there. His oh. asparagus smells funny. Truth. I'm telling you, he's a, he's, he's a different kind of individual. He's made different. I've he learned. can get Chick-fil-A on Sundays. Did you know that? I've learned so much about Mysterioso through you and these facts. Uh-oh, oh. wheelbarrow caught him. Traps the legs, Two. twist him up. Nope. Mysterioso is looking to drive those knees into Mystico, but he, Mystico had him scouted. And this is vintage Mystico right here. Look at that. Wow. At this late stage of the match, to be able to still pull that incredible aerial move off. I'm telling you, he has the most incredible recuperative abilities. His fast twitch muscles are like no other. And going in a different direction this time. Oh! But Mysterioso pulls him face first directly in to the edge of the ring. And now. Oh no, watch out. Oh! Man! Mystico was almost like, come on, I dare you, and Mysterioso did it. That's a lot of weight coming down on you. I mean, I applaud the, the, the bravery of Mystico, but is that really a, a smart move? Well, again, if it leads to the victory, you could say, yeah, you got to sure. do what you got to do to beat a, a legend like Mystico. I mean, I mean, what kind of thoughts could be implanted in your head when you're about to fly onto your opponent and your opponent's mocking you? Right. Come on, do it. I mean, that's got to screw well, with your confidence a little bit. And ten. Well, Mystico and Mysterioso, it, it looks like that Tope Conhilo may have taken as much out of Mysterioso as it did Mystico. Well, he also kind of crashed on that fence a little bit. Yeah. 15. It's an effective but also uh, risky maneuver 16. here. You take a lot of damage to yourself. See, Mr. Elsa is moving much slower. Mystico trying to get the crowd behind him, getting that adrenaline that he's famous for. Back elbow. Uh oh. This could be catastrophic. Oh, man. Got all of it. Flushed. Oh. No, he kicked out. Wow. Mystico still somehow kicking out. Ten minutes past. Ten minutes. Halfway through our 20-minute time limit. And I can't imagine that this match is going to go that much longer, folks. Don't go anywhere. Because the end could be near. It could be right here. Yeah, after that moonsault, I mean, this could be. Oh, my God. How in a world of mystical. Incredible. The amount of punishment he has taken. Fans here. Oh no, this is oh, bad. Oh, look at that! Spanish fly off the top. Cross the arms, hook the leg, and oh, no, he still kicked out. Man, I I love this. I mean, this could be the main event, but we still have a main event coming up. Peter Avalon challenging Fred Rosser for a strong open weight championship. One man, point, thirty minutes. So you're gonna get a. Chock full episode of New Japan Strong here. Because both Avalon and Rosser are built to go the distance. And now here we are past the 10 minute mark in our semifinal. Zero, so in a predicament here. Right on the Yaitza here. Oh, wait a minute now. Mystico trying to get the fuel for the tank via the crowd. Mysterio. Oh, man. Cover two. No. Man, and Mystico Mysterioso giving these fans here in Vermont everything they have. We're getting a main event Friday night. Arena Mexico match here on Strong. Oh. Mystica! La Mystica! He got him! From Mystico! He got and him! Armbar, and it is Submission City. How many matches has Mystico won with that over the years? How many falls? Mystico! This was his move. He has captured many titles, many masks. 
Man, I gotta say, looking at Mystico, it's so, so nostalgic. And it brings me back to 2008. Mexico sold out Arena Mexico. What a treat we had here tonight. The winner is Mystico. Uh, again, you can, I can now check that one off. I got to call a Mystico match. That's pretty cool. And he brought everything. And, and so did Mysterioso. Oh, absolutely. And I wondered if Mysterioso might be feeling that, because he knows the legends, yeah. Lucha Libre, and he knows Mystico's name and the panoply of all the greats. He held it together the whole way through. And there is no shame in dropping the decision to Mystico. So folks, that's our semifinal. And what that means next is our main event. And our main event is for the strong open weight championship challenger. Peter Avalon, one-on-one -on -one with the champion, Fred Rosser. The winner faces Kenta at Battle in the Valley. Don't you go anywhere. Our main event is next. When you've got a strong open weight title match as your main event, you know you picked the right episode of New Japan Strong to tune into. It's Alex Kozlov, Kevin Kelly here with you. And my thought about tonight with Fred Rosser defending that strong open weight title against Peter Avalon. We know that the winner of tonight's title bout faces Kenta, February 18th, Battle in the Valley. Is there a danger of Fred Rosser potentially overlooking Peter Avalon too focused on the next number one contender, Kenta. Look, first of all, when I have Kenta to think about if I can get through my next opponent, I'd have a lot of anxiety. But this is Fred Rosser, Mr. No Days Off. That's all he does. He watches the tape, he trains. I don't think with everything that he went through to get this title, True. for him to overlook whoever he may be, Peter Avalon, whether he deserves it or not, let's not mm -hmm. forget, he is undefeated. True. I don't think Fred Rosser is overlooking him. I am definitely looking forward to a battle of legendary luchadors. We've got Mystico versus Mysterioso. I hope you found out some more Mysterioso facts. I mean, I've been gone in Japan a whole year. Uh, there, there are some details that I will share with you later on. Please tell when we get the match in the ring and we kick things off. We'll head to the ring momentarily to see Kita one on one against Blake Christian. This match is going to cook. This week on New Japan Strong.
Watch every Saturday on NJPWWorld.com and on Fight TV.